welcome back to Eastern Tunery. Tractors at your auctions. Yes, I know I've done so many videos before. Every video is different, and I generally have a passion for these tractors here. So uh, we're going to put it around and see what's here. Then we'll watch someone going under the hammer. And um, put some proper nice tractors here today. So we'll have a look, and uh, probably I'd like to take those off home. But uh, there we go. There's an amazing amount of tractors here today. So people here putting through their paces, trying them all out. Every colour and all age, and all ages. Whilst I know we run a load of big tractors like that, I do find these old ones very, very much more interesting. I know a lot of these counters have been in uh, imported from foreign lands. I still find them good. This is a very tidy one, this is a 2640 20, Massey. My first father in law had a um, 2620 Massey. And we used to call it Nessie because it was a big old lump. I've probably mentioned that before on YouTube, sorry if I have. But in its day, it was a big tractor. The H pack gearbox over there. See what year this tractor is. On an H registration, so she's a, she's a few years under her belt. And to be fair, to be fair it's actually survived the rust um, quite well, so it's been well cared for. And I think one of these tractors, or very similar, or definitely a 2000 series tractor in Sheffield the other day, made colossal money. So, we'll see a tractor here. Kubota, David Brown, Edison Forson. Lovely little Dexter there. And a Super Dexter. Difference being the bonnets in the visible sea. Dexter's got the rounded bonnet. And the Super Dexter. We've got a variation of a bonnet there, so. There's a, now that's rare, that is rare. I don't think I've actually seen another one. A um, Fordson, I believe that is an E27N, I'm sure. With a Perkins P6 engine in it, with a loader. So I definitely think that's, I don't think I can honestly say I've ever seen one of those with a loader on before. Definitely different. Oh, especially having a winch on the back as well. If you come away from the Forson, here's a local tractor to us. A Pouch and Son, Party Dairies. Just around the road from where we live. Yeah, sold from a Christmas in Hornpastle. Christmas Depot is now a Tur Turnbull's Builders Merchants, but. There we go, that's a, that is a nice little tractor. I suspect that's probably been on the farm from you. Very smart, very straight. On an M registration. Quite surprised to see it here, really. I think it's got power steering as well. Not too sure, but there we go. A local tractor. Where we live, 4630, and another 2000 series Massey two wheel drive variation 2620. That's the rear window that then will become a super cute. Very cute variation there. Very tidy super Q 7610, Mark 3, Series 3. Then the 7710, 98 horsepower. 
Don't see that many as two-wheel drives. Earlier 7700s you see more, but tidy tractor. However, something that does confuse me with this tractor is the rear window. I don't think I've ever seen a UK spec tractor with that rear window in it. I might be wrong. But is anybody else? Please let us know the boxes below. Have you seen a UK spec tractor with that rear window in it? The American, yes. Some of the European, but not the UK. Now this is a little beauty. <laughs> not quite sure whether it's a county or a board there. Or it could easily be a roadless conversion. With a winch on the back. I don't think, I don't think he's ever had hydraulic arms on it. I don't think that's got the actual brackets down there. I don't think there's any bits on the top on the top there for lifting. But uh, so it could have easily had a, could have easily been a winch tractor from you. So a couple more counties. But which way you look here, the tractors. So, here's a very tidy little 154S Massey. I know, as we said before, the F stands for fruit. I'm not quite sure what the S stands for. If somebody knows, I'd love to know, but it's got, it's got the wheels set out wide. But definitely a fruit stroke vineyard spec tractor. Crank link, link arms in the mouth, narrow width, but an English registered tractor as well. So, uh, very tidy example. Got another 35 there. So. Yeah, tractors everywhere. Don't see many of these in the UK, really. Valerius tractor. It sounds really sweet. Cab looks very well cared for as well, so that's quite a nice clean tractor. T7220 heading to the ramp. There's a happy driver there, which is good. Tidy. Nice early fast track. Fast track 125, I bet that is. I wonder what year she's going to be. Oh, J Reg. That's got the Reg got smaller wheels too, so. T7210, heading off. Thirteen plane. We're going to see what they make in a minute. Certainly a high of activity. I have to say, I've seen quite a few, this fast track here has obviously got a bit of rust on her. And I have seen quite a few fast tracks with rust on them, but uh, definitely a bit of TLC at home, a bit shop last wouldn't put right. Haven't they come a long way, fast tracks, in their time? They really have. They've got an awful lot more complicated. I'm not sure it's always better, but yeah. Now that's a weapon, look at that, look at this, look at the wrapping on the bonnet of that shire horse. Nine, nine series pen. I love I love the writing on the, the star writing on the bonnet. How cool is that? That's very cool. So, Heading off to the ramp now. 
real nice guy driving, I had a chat with him, and he's overwhelmed by the amount of switches and controls in that cab. So yeah, very much so. The tractor now queuing up to go over the ramp. It's all lined up there. A very well orchestrated uh, set up here. Two stars that don't know it. Nice track here. The good thing is you see them all running here, so if they smoke or these whatever, you can see see the money. It's a good way. To, it's a very good way to do an auction. There's the Ford County Road, just whatever it might be. There's the 717. Looking very smart there. Right, we get back down now and have a look at this uh, massive 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 massive
Right, I'm back home. So, thank you for watching this video on the tractors at your auctions. Um, I'm a bit, I, I, I love tractors, always have done. So, I do get quite enthusiastic about <laughs> seeing all those various tractors. If you like tractors, there is a tractor run. I have mentioned it before. This coming Sunday, Farmer Brown's Ice Cream. Um, Google it, it comes up. There's a tractor on there in aid of charity. Charity, in aid of charity. There will be a lot of tractors there. It's good to go and see it, good to go and support it. Um, so yeah, go and, have, go and have a look at those. And then in, I think the 9th and 10th of November, there is the Newark Heritage and Tractor Show at Newark Showground. Um, I will definitely be there um, on Saturday, and probably the Sunday as well. So if you're there, come along and say hello. So anyway, thanks for watching. If, if you've made it this far and you haven't, please click the, press the subscribe button ring the little bell, you know all the full works. So anyway, thanks for watching. See you next video. Jobs are good. Thank you.